Welcome back everybody to another episode of Project Spark. Today I'm playing a game called Zanbara and it does have a lot of foreign language written around here so I think it's made by someone not um, from the US but that's not a bad thing. I think it's going to be really good. It's got a 8.4 rating so I'm going to try to check it out and I hope that most of it's in English. Um, it's the only thing I really have here is defeat stone creatures and boss. So uh, I'm excited about it. It looks cool from the screenshot there. Stone creatures. Um, I don't know what those are, but maybe we'll figure it out. And uh, ooh, we do get an English option, so very good. <laughs> Heavy attack looks easy enough. Hack and slash basics. Hey, you. Well, hey, you too. You shouldn't go any further. I need a shirt, man. <laughs> that valley is cursed by a witch. With creatures of living stone, stone monsters attack wanderers like us. All right, well, hey, <laughs> I guess my guy doesn't care. I'm a badass, all right? I walk around without a shirt, strolling through stone. Oh, I'm a stone cutter. All right, so that's really not what I'm worried about. I guess stone creatures are not, not scary to me because I'm, I'm used to cutting stone. And as a stone cutter, of course. Oh, what is this guy? Look at him with this big stone arm. Crush, crush. Oh, these guys are easy. Come on. I need bigger stones than that. Do stone cutters generally not wear shirts? Am I not getting, like, fractured stone stuck in my skin? <laughs> There's a lot of these stones, but at least they're easy to break. There's a strong axe. Chop, chop. Oh, they're chucking rocks at me, man. Not cool. That could really damage my noggin. I need a helmet. Oh! Rocks! I like that one. He's got a big round head. Oh, look! He's got. He lives after you chop him once. He starts walking around. Maybe he's gonna. Oh, he's bringing the other stone creatures to life. Oh, maybe this is not good. I need to go chop him before he brings some more to life that I'm not ready for. Oh no, come on! C Stop walking around, you big... <laughs> I like how there's different um, different of these stone entities. It's not just uh, one type. And they're hitting me with those rocks. They're hurting me a little bit, but uh, not too much. Oh, is there something green over here? Is that like a power-up? Oh, I think it's just a leaf falling. Oh, here's one of those walkers. We gotta get him run. Get him gone. I think they're each specialized for different things. Uh, these ones chuck the rocks here. These walkers here have like a second life to go pick up more rock guys. And these ones here have a big arm to smash with. Oh yeah, I made it through there. Oh, what's this guy? Did he come out of a different one? I killed one and it like respawned as a smaller one? I think this is the way to go, right? I don't think this is where I came from. Let's see if that dude's there. He says, hey. Uh-oh. Whoa, big growing rock. Interesting. <laughs> those those rocks grew out of nowhere. Um, okay, so there maybe there's like waves coming at me now. I could see that. Does that one have like a sharp claw? Rock claw? Rock monsters. He was a rock monster. <laughs> These guys are easy, though. I think that there is going to be a boss. Um, probably a, a larger rock. Ouch! Hit me with your perfect cylindrical rocks. <clears throat> Excuse me. Man, there's a lot of them, though. It is, uh, it's getting a little bit overwhelming. I got some health from somewhere. Something's giving me health. Because I was hurt. Ouch! Rock to the face. Uh, uh. I haven't been really using my heavy attack. I've just been using the normal attack, right? Ah. Man, lots of rocks, so... Where's the boss at? <laughs> lots of these little guys. I'm gonna chop these guys up. Chop! Chop! Oh! Okay, that looks like the sign of boss. Okay, he's a... He's a big rock monster. Holy cow, he's big! Oh! He's got a fire-breathing eye of siren! <laughs> Oh my gosh! Run away, run away! Okay, um, I think I should just go in at him. Is he gonna hit me with that tree? Ugh! He doesn't seem to be swinging. He's too high up there to get me, but he can 
shoot those fireballs down at me. Raining fireballs. I don't see his health bar or anything. Ooh, the fireballs do hurt a lot. They hurt. It hurts me. Jeez, get him. I got some health again somehow. I think maybe I regain health. Is that it? He's going down? Or maybe now I can chop at his head. No, I think that was it, right? Let's see, I'm gonna go over there maybe. That's his head, right? I'm gonna chop his head up. Hurrah! Yeah, there we go. And now we're getting him. I tripped him and now we're gonna chop on his head. And then he exploded into little rock bits. <laughs> oh yeah. Look at my ches chiseled muscles. No wonder I don't wear a shirt to impress this lady. No, impossible. My masterpiece. I spent almost my entire life destroyed by a mere human. Mere human. Look at me. No, I don't want to kill you. <laughs> Just walk away. I am a stone cutter, not a head chopper. Oh, you. This is a, this is a very interesting cinematic. Um, should take advice from others. He said he thought he thought the monster kicked my butt. No, I kicked the monster's butt, sir. You've got it all wrong. <laughs> interesting, very, very interesting story behind that game. Um, it was a uh, a little bit short, but that's all right. Uh, I did enjoy it. I did chop up those stones pretty good. I'll give it a thumbs up. It was fun. There was uh not a whole lot of. I wish I was like collecting some coins or something. Maybe I could upgrade my weapon, something like that, to make it a little bit better. But um, I did enjoy it. So <laughs> the dialogue in it was a little bit strange. Anyway, I'm going to be cutting it here, guys. As always, I'm Chronic Mischief. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.